go. And then every corner. And there we have one there already. And one there already. And then every corner. Some of these buildings are quite interesting. Look at those. You can amuse yourself with looking at buildings while I slowly do this. Now, there's one there already, one there, and there, and there. Wait, that's wrong. Why did I do that? I don't need that there. Again, demolishing people's houses on accident. There we go. And nobody, like, this thing, this monument, nobody actually works there. Look at that. Work is none. They look awesome. They uh, help with the demand cap, but otherwise they don't actually do anything for your city. Let's see. Bus stop on every corner. And then... Bus stop every other corner, because there's ones there already, and then bus stop every one. Did I? Hmm, okay. Yeah, so... Big city is not all that interesting to play. Like with a smaller city, you can just do your experiments quite quickly. You can just kind of put a bunch of things down and then watch what happens. With a big city, it takes forever to, to simulate. Forever to build anything, first of all, and then forever to simulate. So just not very responsive. Not as entertaining as you might expect. Okay, he's gonna be... Slightly more... Wow, look at those factories get destroyed by our bus stops. Uh, yep. There, 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 and there. I, I don't know if we really need this many bus stops in the industrial area, to be honest, but we're putting them in, whether we need them or not. Alright. Wow, we demolished demolish so many factories. And there, and then we'll not do that, because there's a... Uh, that's a bit complicated. Alright, so every other one, and then every one. Okay, and then every other one. So there's one there already, let's put one there as well. Hmm, no water, no way. Apparently I'm out of water again. That's a problem. Let me just put that down. Let's check the water situation. Not that. Power, water, okay. Not really a huge problem just yet, especially since I'm demolishing buildings for these. But I do need more power and I need more water. 
Uh, if I put in a hydrogen plant, all that surplus is going to disappear. What to do? What to do? I don't know. I don't know what to do. I guess I'll do it. Or I can, I can, you know, I can save the game and then do it. That might be the best thing to do. Save the game and then just try it out. Alright. And uh, every other one... Or is taking a long time. Is it a is it a skyscraper being built? I think it is. I haven't checked the the hospitals and schools for a while, have I? Maybe I need to do that. That's already built there. That and that. All right. I mean, if, if if the pattern of bus stops aren't, you know, if I miss some, it doesn't really matter too much. It's not essential to the city. It just helps the traffic a little bit. Hopefully, there's a chance that it might not actually help the city at all. Oh, wait, I don't have money. I don't have enough money for the hydrogen plant. Do I? Because I spent all of it on the subway. Well, that's a problem. This really is taking forever. Wow. Oh, look. Two skyscrapers back to back. Giving me more traffic problems, you guys. Oh, look at that. So that just happened. And I'm, I'm losing more money as well. Like I'm, I'm using more money on these bus stops. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I still have enough money for the new power plant. That's the wrong place. Or is it? No, that's not the wrong place, it's the right place. Alright, so there, 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 there. There we go. And the thing is, like, if you don't have enough bus stations, they don't even work. Like, imagine if you have all, of, all your bus stations in residential areas. No one's gonna take them at all. Or, you know, if, if the if the buses don't go where people need to go, they're just not going to take them. So you actually need a lot of bus stations before any of them start being useful. You know, if you have one bus station, it doesn't really, you know, doesn't do anything, right? Whereas the more you have, the more useful they become. 
Um, hmm, okay, let's just check all the funding levels. Wow, that's a problem. That's fine. That's a problem. That's already reached maximum, in fact. Oh, that's a problem. Okay. Wow. Abandoned due to commute time. So you see, the commute is a problem. I just don't know... I'm just not sure how to fix it. Wow, I know all these things appear. Scary. Scary, wow. <laughs> to manage all these things. Uh, that's still okay. Not for long though. That's not so bad. That's, in fact, it's overfunded. Let's just bump that up. That's also overfunded. That's interesting. We've got some population decline there. That's fine. That's kind of fine. Yep. Okay, so that that's still fine. Now where are my... My main... Okay, okay, let's bump that up to... 63,000. Uh, 63,000. There we go. University. Increase the funding. Uh, disease Research Center. Increase that funding. There you go. All right, everything's good. Um, hmm. Oh, we need more power and water. How much does the hydrogen power plant cost? Oh, I can afford it. I can afford it. Um, traffic. Let me just look at this. Traffic volume. All the cars disappeared. The subway hasn't actually registered yet. Is that right? So a lot of cars disappeared. Actually, there's a little bit of subway there. Look at that. A little bit of subway there. Not much, though. Pedestrian and buses, for sure. I don't... Half the cars disappeared. That might be a, uh, a glitch. That might not actually be the case. Because there's still that. It's a little bit smarter, though. They're taking the... They're taking more of the highway, I think. Um, Alright, more importantly, you're going to put in some more water. Need to increase the water supply. And there you go. And, um... Power. I'm really, really... Hesitating on the power. Okay, let's let's do it. Let's not mess around anymore. Pause. Save the game. Come on, save the game. Right, and uh, currently we are using 6,000, one, two... Actually, I can just increase the funding on these. I won't, though. One, two, three, four. 24,000 megawatts. Um, demolish, 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 demolish. Ha! Ah, good job! <laughs> um, and then... I need to find a place to fit this, because it doesn't fit there. Can I dezone? A part of this? I can dezone a part of that. Alright, dezone part of that. P 
put that in. There goes all my money. I think I can do that. Okay, capacity is not enough. Uh, I can do that. Wow. Wow, crazy. Crazy times in this city. Look at that. Alright, power is good. Money is... Wow. Okay. My surplus has disappeared. Um, the other thing we're gonna do is move the the waste to energy plants to the other side of the city. All right, I'm gonna extend the avenues to there and. We're going to build waste energy plants. One, two, and crap. Well, okay. I sh maybe I should have thought about this beforehand. In any case, we can demolish one and two. Uh, maybe I should have thought about this beforehand. Oh, we're still we're still in in profit mode. Okay, now I'm gonna increase the funding even on those things. Increase the funding on that. Burn all that rubbish. Good. <laughs> now we have like a a six hundred dollar profit, which is not good at all. Wow. Why did the... I don't understand why the demand collapsed like that. What did I do to, to make that happen? That demand is off the charts. Did they just build a whole lot of high-rises and then wreck the demand? Is that what they did? Hmm... Oh look! Am I? Did that suddenly make a lot more money? How did that happen? Wait, let me check what happened there. Income expenses. <laughs> Why did I suddenly get a lot of tax income? Is it because the property value? I think the property values jumped because I removed the pollution. Let me just see the the, the land value. Oh no, it's still pretty bad, although it's getting better here. It's getting substantially better, even as we look at it. Alright, so we're back to three and a half thousand dollar profit per month. I can, I can handle that. Oh crap. That's not good. What happened there? Oh no, power is fine. Power is fine. That's not fine, though. Why is that...? Okay, no- oh, the power's not being used here, I see. Okay, the power lines. My bad. Alright, there we go, there we go, my bad. Alright, so now we're back to something reasonable. Can I even reduce the funding... just a little bit? Maybe not that much. Let's reduce the funding to 7,600. And we're continuing to remove the garbage, right? Let me just see the garbage. Yep, the garbage is still slowly going down. Although that, that's not... That's kind of slowing a little bit. Let's dezone that. Dezone that, because we don't need that anymore, I don't think. Interesting. Well... So the monthly income is actually improving again. We're back to 
five and a half thousand profit already. Wow, that's amazing. What happened? Did the land value go up that much? I don't know what happened there. Like, why am I getting suddenly so much more money coming in? Because, like, you see that, right? Like, that's the power plant. That's the subway going in and the and the bus stops. Or is it? No, no, no. That can't be right. That's five years. But that's definitely the the power plant going in. I thought they would have eaten up all my money, but apparently not. That worked out better than expected. Wait a minute, that's back down to... 3,000. Why is that fluctuating so much? Anyway, never mind. Still... Wow, that demand is jumping back and forth. That's still crazy. That's still not very good. Uh, let's see the... the traffic volume. Ah, uh, look at that. So the... Ah, cars. That's interesting. So people are really taking to the public transport now. So they're shifting more and more to the subways and the buses, even though the cars are still quite high. So people are, are trying to decide whether to take the, the the public transit or to take their cars. But you can see the it's definitely declined the amount of cars on the road, which is a good thing. Uh, can we see traffic? What is this? What is this? What is this? What is what is this? Okay, where are these people going? So they come in here. They okay, they find jobs there. But that's only... oh, that's quite a few of them. So they come in here... They... find jobs there. Okay. So they're not actually traveling out of the city anymore. They're finding jobs in the city. Although they're finding jobs in the most inconvenient of places. There. So they're traveling all the way across the city. But what's what was that? So let me just turn that traffic on. That there, what is this? Um turn that off. Five thousand cars. These are five thousand cars. Five thousand six thousand cars. Five thousand cars. 300 cars. So between here and here they've disappeared. Is that, is that, am I reading this right? 5,000 cars. No, they're turning... They're turning in here. Let me just check this. It's got people taking the subway. What is this? Look at this. They walk from there to the subway station. They take the subway to there, get off, take the bus out. Why don't you just take the bus from there? Wow, these people are dumb. <laughs> these people are dumb. <laughs> that makes no sense. Bus, so a lot of people are going next door to find jobs. Let me just check the traffic again. Where's the problem? Okay, there's a problem here. 5,000 cars, where are these people going? They are 3,000, 4,000. They're traveling to, uh, what's it? Arcadia is the name of that city. So they're traveling that way. For some reason, they don't travel through any of the other roads that they have available to them. And they travel all the way here to work. And they don't, they don't take the highway. But you know, there's a highway there that they can take. They all go this way, and that's the problem there because they can't go through here. Look, I don't know. These people are just dumb, man. Um, 
But maybe we just need to let the, the traffic simulate a bit more. And maybe we need more highways. Like maybe we need a highway across this way. Like what is this? What's happening there? Coming through here and across there. But there's 3,000 people on that highway and they're coming to work. Okay, I see. I mean, it's not that bad. Let me just see a graph. Uh, traffic volume. Alright, they've decided they're gonna take that much public transport, not much more. More buses than. I mean, there's more bus stations, I know that, but you can take the bus to the subway, alright? I don't know, so they're stabilizing there. Commute time is. Seriously. I spent all that money and no change in the commute time. Actually, that's not a. It's not a. It's not, it's not that surprising. I mean, it might seem surprising to you, but what happens is. Uh, uh, studies have been done, like, like, people tend to spend the same amount of time traveling per day. Like, they're, 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 you know, they're willing to spend a certain amount of time traveling a day. If the traffic is less congested, it means they can go further. So they'll, they'll go to more places if the travel, if the, if the traffic is less congested. Whereas if the traffic is more congested, they'll spend the same time on the road but they end up going to fewer places in their life. It's interesting, because people kind of... You, know, you, you might think, well, you know, if the traffic's better, they just spend less time traveling. It's not really the case. I mean, I mean, it's obviously, it's different for each individual, but on average, it just means that people will travel further to go to work, or they'll go take more, you know, they'll, they'll take more time away and, and travel somewhere else, or you know, they'll go to see their friends, or, you know, go watch a movie or whatever. Whereas if, if they're spending more time sitting in traffic, then they'll go out less, in a way. <laughs> it's funny like that. So, you know, commute time might not actually improve, even if you improve the traffic. But it doesn't mean that people's lives don't improve, because they're, you know, they're getting to more places. It just means that the commute time doesn't... They, you know, they, still, they still spend the same amount of time in traffic, as it were. Air pollution has gone down. Not all that much, though. Jobs and population. Okay, a lot of poor people just moved into my city. That's interesting. And I guess the... Huh, yes, yeah, so a lot of poor people moved in. And I guess the, the public transit helps with that as well, because it means those guys can, can get to where they need to go. Because poor people tend to take public transit more than rich people. Huh, that's interesting. I do wish people would take the... the subways more. I'm not gonna build any more subways at the moment. I don't actually have the money to do that. 